Julie from the Heart of Feather Heart Temple YouTube site, 531-2016. <clears throat> I wanted to talk a little bit more about those that go, th that take their hands through your energy fields and the people who do massages or massage therapy. Never, you know, your, your body and your energy fields that surround your body or that emanate from your body that is your sacred space and that is why anyone who goes near it or touches it should be worthy of trust now And this is for those who like the massages that they get from perfect strangers. Think about the person that the massage therapist touched before you. A lot of these people are in physical pain. And a lot of the physical pain is from, stems from either karmic debt or some, it could be, it could be depression. It could be an entity attachment. It could be a personal haunting. I don't know if any of you know about this, but peep, there are people on this planet who are haunted. And when these massage things go on, I call it an energy dumping, uh, energy swapping, dumping garbage dump, where the energy goes from one person to the other. So it is so important that Anybody who goes near your sacred space, they must be worthy of trust. Because what if that massage therapist t touched a pedophile before touching your energy fields? Or touched a rapist, massaged a rapist, and then massaged your energy fields don't believe for one minute that you cannot get corrupted that way have a beautiful day beautiful people just be very careful again about who shares your sacred space it is so important